Hi, welcome to Hardrisk Info. Now I'm going to show you how to scan documents to your smartphone, to your iPhone. To do this on Epson XP7100 printer, firstly, you should download and install Epson iPrint application. Then connect your printer to this app. Um, connect this printer to this app and uh, now we can scan documents if you don't know how to connect your printer to this application you should watch our video about it because it's very easy to do i created a comprehensive and completed guide uh, to to connect your printer to the wi-fi network and to connect your device to the mobile app okay so here as you can see our printer is your printer uh, has to be chosen here, here, as you can see, and then when your printer is chosen here, you will wait, well, you will see the name of your printer here on this blue line. And now, and now, uh, place the document on the scanner glass. That's good. Here we have the lid. Open the lid, and here we have the scanner glass right here and we should locate our document on this scanner glass so here is my document as you can see here is my document and here is the right bottom corner of our scanning glass here we have a narrow log it means that the left top uh, corner of our document we should locate in this uh, right bottom corner of the printers printers glass so how to do that so here, as you can see, the left top corner of my document. And now I should locate this corner in the right bottom corner, okay? And close the lid. It's very important to close the lid. And now, after closing the lid, find scan button, click on it and click scan. Originals are not loaded. Um, okay, and it's very, 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 very interesting moment because by default, I really don't know why it uh, wanna uh, scan it like ADF. But to print, to scan document, why you have when you have this problem, just click on the settings button in the right top corner of the screen, and here you have the source. Click on the source button and find document table and click on it and then go back click down and click scan wait a while as you can see scanning the original and cool here on our device on my smartphone i have a scan of the document now what can i do with it we can just click on the save button then choose where we can uh, save it so for example to uh, local folder to okay so i want to save it in local folder, folder for example in pdf or in gpack so in pdf click save and it will save it to uh, apps and print application on your smartphone or you just can click on the message button then select the format click mail and send it to to, to, to to your email for example and you can click print button and print this document so that's it thanks for watching hope this video was helpful for you and bye see you